Well, I don't really care about offending people. I sort of thought you'd know that. What people love about you is you speak your mind and you don't use a politician's filter. However, that is not without its downsides, in particular when it comes to women. You've called women you don't like fat pigs, dogs, slobs, and disgusting animals. Your Twitter account Only is Rosie several... O'Donnell. Once it was reluctantly aroused. It was hard to get it aroused, and it is hard to get it aroused, but we got it aroused. Look, look, look. You know you're a fake. You know that your whole network, the way you cover it, is fake. And most of you, and not all of you, but the people are wise to you. That's why you have a lower, a lower approval rating than you've ever had before, times probably three. And when you ask me that question... It's just awfully good that someone with the temperament of Donald Trump is not in charge of the law in our country. Yeah. Because you'd be in jail. Secretary Clinton. <laughs> to be president. To be president, you have to be sharp and tough and so many other things. They, he doesn't even come out of his basement. They think, oh, this is a great campaign. So he goes in. I'll then make a speech. It'll be a great speech. And some young guys start writing. Pre Vice President Biden said this, 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 this. He didn't say it. Joe doesn't know he's alive, okay? What's the difference between a wet raccoon and Donald J. Trump's hair? A wet raccoon doesn't have seven billion fucking dollars in the bank. No, get those lights off. Off. Turn them off. They're too, they're too bright. Turn them off. Turn them off. Let's go. Ready? Turn off the lights. Turn off the lights. Turn off the lights. Turn them off. So much nicer. I am the chosen one. Somebody had to do it. So I'm taking on China. I just feel like a young man. I'm so young. I can't believe it. I'm the youngest person. I am a young, vibrant man. I look at Joe. I don't know about him. I don't know. I would never say anyone's too old, but I know they're all making me look very young, both in terms of age and I think in terms of energy. I think you people know that. I close up the country. Go ahead, please. The first, the first of the month is next week. That's why your ratings are so bad, because you're pathetic. Go ahead, let's go. Your ratings are terrible. Look at those hands. Are they small hands? <laughs> and he referred to my hands. If they're small, something else must be small. I guarantee you there's no problem. I guarantee you. Uh, okay. First went through... Russia, Russia, Russia. It was all bullshit. What? The launch? The rocket launch? Uh, I'm thinking about going. Uh, that'll be next week to the rocket launch. I hope you're all going to join me. I'd like to put you on the rocket and get rid of you for a while. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you, Steve. Thank you. What do you think is Joe Biden's strongest feature as a competitor in politics? Well, I would have said experience, but he doesn't really have experience because I don't think he remembers what he did yesterday. So how is that experience? He's been there a long time. He was never known as a smart person. Pick one good thing. Uh... Okay, what is his weakest point? I can't think? tell you. I, I mean, I'm really serious. He's got many. I could talk about weak points all day. Business oh, to run for oh, president. I know. You're a tough guy, Jeb. And, it's, and we need to have a leader that is pr real principled. Tough. You're never going to be president of the United States tough, by insulting Jeb, your way to well, the let's presidency. Let's see. I'm at 42 and you're at 3. So, Doesn't so matter. far, I'm doing better. Doesn't matter. So far, I'm doing better. You know, you started off over here, Jeb. You're moving over further and further. Pretty soon, you're going to be off the end. This I'll doesn't do there. a thing to yeah, solve one the problem. Any contact, though, just to make sure. Who do? The North Koreans. I don't want to say. I, I won't say that. Okay. Um, we so, have a good relationship with North Korea. As good as you can have. I mean, we have a good relationship with North Korea. Uh, I have a good relationship with Kim Jong-un, and I hope he's okay. And somebody would say, oh, that's terrible. No, it's not terrible. I hope he's okay. And I think it was a fake report done by CNN. So can I ask you a question? What do you have? Go ahead. I, I, no, that's I, enough. Go ahead. 
But that wasn't a, my question. The problem is you don't write the truth. So, you know, as far as I'm concerned, I want to go I want to go to the next Can I ask you a question about Rick? No, not CNN, please. Go ahead. The White House has not you don't, responded to I told you. CNN is fake news. Don't talk to me. Go ahead, please. But he says he was retaliated against, and that's why he was removed from his job. Do you have a response to that? Okay, next question. Mr. President, I have two questions, one on behalf of a 